Today I'm doing a video on my five drawer Harbor Freight Mechanics tool cart. Um, gonna do a tour and the mods that I've done to make it mine. Uh, first things first, it's labeled, lettered up and under Snap-on. That was a joke between me and the Snap-on guy. He thought it was funny, I thought it was funny. It's actually fooled a lot of people. Uh, right away in the top, we got socket tray. This is, I think, Torin with a set of CAD impact sockets and some chrome snap-on ones. These are snap-on half-inch drive Allens. And these are CAT, which CAT tools are snap-on tools, just rebranded, they're the same thing. Um, Sun-X sockets back here with a swivel. More Sun-X sockets, this one's actually a snap-on, this one's a Matco. But I, no, that's another snap-on one right there. Sun-X makes good stuff. Um, over here, I have a couple of the snap-on puck lights. Got pretty good deals on them. Uh, Matco bit driver set with T-handle. 3 a drive sockets. Uh, snap-on and Mac on a Westling. Uh, right there, Westling machine. Right, aluminum rail, these things are awesome. Uh, three ace, half inch, and three quarter inch extensions lined up in there. I got a half inch snap on ratchet and then the big 24 inch flex head one. Right here, I got a snap on quarter inch ratchet with some quarter inch sockets, both snap on a Mac. Icon little stubby ratchet. This thing is nice. I would, uh, I would actually put that up against any snap on thing snap on makes. It's pretty awesome. Uh, pry bar, screwdrivers, various little screwdrivers, little pry bar. This is my 3 ace snap-on ratchet. Use that thing all the time. Uh, got a tape measure and a knife. Over here, I got more Allens. These are standard. These are metric. Then I got Torx, inverted Torx, and then some kind of random quarter and stuff. All these are Wesley machine rails. Um, they work awesome. I love them. Air chuck. Uh, side table, I did get the upgraded one. You had to cut the fit and then put some contact adhesive, but I like it a lot better than bare metal. And I did the same thing for here because the one that came with it just kind of wore out. Uh, top drawers, I got, this is my air tool drawer, so I got die grinders, 90s, uh, little gun, it's Mac, three eight, or half inch, excuse me, Stubby impact works pretty sweet. Earmuffs, snap on, air hammer, cut off wheels, sample tool, taking samples. Next top drawer is got a magnet, hammers, some batteries, ibuprofen. Every mechanic needs to have that in their toolbox. Spare flashlight. Plagers drawer. This is a homemade deal made actually out of a piece of wire rack it works all right and it fits pretty good so um mac snap on nipex nipex are awesome everybody needs to have a set of them punch holder vice grips snap on flesh cutter some extent uh long needle noses pwz's these things are awesome i don't use them a whole lot anymore but boy are they great when you need them next drawer down wrenches snap on the standard set i mostly use standards at my job right now um ratcheting five fifteen sixteenths a couple more snap on paint pen marker ball end allen wrenches snap on adjustable wrench mac stubbies metric i got these this is a max set and it's the ratcheting flex head from 19 to 7. I got both that and the standard version. Got some crow's feet. Bottom drawer. I got a DeWalt drill, Mac half inch, a Mac 3 8 impacts. I got the snap on 3 8 electric ratchet. Harbor freight, big wrenches, uh, big pry bar filter wrenches. Got a headlight and a filter tool down there. Punches, drill bits. Got a bolt tool. Tell you the size of bolt and thread pitch. It's really handy. 
um, some Harbor Freight. These are actually the same wrenches as them. I bought the same set twice for 40 bucks, and then I cut these in half. So when you don't quite got enough room, but a crow foot won't cut it either. Uh, down underneath, I got plug box, plug O-rings. I got a impact and some solvent cleaners, a tub for various things. Over here, you can see my extensions. I got a set of magnetic leads, funnel, air tool oil, some other random lubricants, and Loctite. I have safety lockout stuff there. Transgel. Everybody needs to have Transgel. It's the best assembly lube. It doesn't swell rubber. It dissolves in oil. It's great stuff. I got a Mac, or sorry, Snap-on tray. Keep my magnetic dishes right there. I made this hook out of a piece of threaded rod. I just found the center here, drilled a hole and put two bolts and bent it up a little bit. Keep a glove box for rubber gloves, but also from Harbor Freight. And that's pretty much it. That's what I have and what I've done. Oh, my Big Mac Co Pry bottle is uh in a bracket that I made, just bent a piece of steel and cut a square in it for it. And then pop riveted it on. Um, other than that, that is pretty much it. Hope you guys liked it. See you later.